The next generation of racing games is here. We are talking about Forza 5 on the Xbox One. How are you guys utilizing the power of the Xbox One to make Forza 5 the best looking racer we've ever seen? Well, gosh, we only get this opportunity every eight or ten years, so we're super excited about the new architecture. We were actually involved with the hardware very early on. We helped influence the chipset and designed our rendering engine from the ground up to take advantage of this hardware. So it's a real mesh of hardware and software, and you'll see that with the game running, especially in the graphics. We're running at a full 1080p, 60 frames a second. The game just looks amazing. With our new physically-based material rendering system, you're going to see details and imperfections come out of the car, atmosphere and light on the track, reflections, everything looks amazing. The Forza series is typically known for having some of the most amazing looking cars. How are you guys going to feed into that car enthusiast side of the game? Well, we've announced that we have a new type of car as well, an open wheel. So we have incredible car variety this time around. And now with our physically based rendering material system, we're bringing the surfaces of these cars to life. It's just amazing. When you look at the close-up shots of like the new McLaren P1, you can see slight imperfections, the machining. These are cars and they're machines, but they're built by people. And you can see evidence of human touch on it. Which is what we found in Forza 4, people would ask us, your cars look perfect, how are you gonna make them better? And we said, they do look perfect. In fact, they look too perfect. We, we kind of stumbled into this uncanny valley of cars. Like, people couldn't quite tell what was wrong. They looked a little too perfect, a little too CG. So we really stepped back, look at how light reacts to different surfaces, and that's how we architected our physically based material system to introduce those tiny little imperfections, the orange peel and paint, human machining marks and scratch marks on rotors, armor all on the side of the tire where it wears off to the tread. And even if you're not a car guy, you may not know what orange peel is, but when it's there, it just feels right. The car just looks right, it looks natural, it looks real.